Good afternoon, good morning. My name is Joanna Oliveira and I'm a senior at Freedom Preparatory Academy. Throughout my years, I have grown very much and learned many things. However, none are related to any school material or any knowledge that had to do with the material we were being taught. I would like to talk about something a lot more important, the true aspects that matter within our school. One of the very first aspects that I really learned to appreciate this year was my friends. There were friends that very much were rare to find, those that I could call up at two or three or five o'clock in the morning saying that I had difficulty with a math problem and they would relate. I had friends that very much stressed about their grades just as much as I did. I had friends that I could relate to throughout all the entire year. I also had teachers that I very much connected to all the time. There were teachers that I would visit in their classrooms almost every single day and teachers that bought me books, teachers that taught me life lessons, and teachers that actually showed that they cared about me. These were the very important aspects that I learned that are based on friendship and connections. Another very big aspect of school was my culture. Throughout this year, I have learned so much about my culture and so much about my heritage. Through a school program that's called IHSA, which is Indigenous and Hispanic Student Association, I learned a lot about my culture and how to stand up for it. I learned to get out of my introverted shell that was stopping me from speaking my own voice. I learned how to work in groups. I learned how to lead and I learned how to protect my culture and my people. For this, I have very much made a whole new discovery and a whole lot of more respect for the word honor. To me, honor is now something that I want to bring to my family all the time. And not just to my family, but the ancestors that have given me so much and have made a path for me to move on and to be able to speak for my own culture. Right now, I would like to take a moment to personally tell my parents that I very much appreciate them very much. Le quiero dar gracias a mi familia y a mis padres y a mi madre por haberme traído a donde estoy hoy. No pudiera haber llegado aquí sin ustedes. If you didn't understand what I said, it's okay. I think that I was very much afraid of speaking Spanish, even just in this speech. But I have learned that Spanish and English are very much different sides to the same coin. I have learned that they are both part of me. And throughout this year, I have learned that I must accept both of my cultures as only one. I will be able to accept myself and learn my, my mistakes and learn that from now on, I will very much stand for my culture, stand for everything that I've been taught, and I will not bring this up to my family. Another great aspect that I learned from a lot of this was this point that we have to appreciate everything. Due to the circumstances of COVID-19, a lot has changed. There has been many incidents where my life has changed completely. It did a 180 and changed all of the aspects of my life. It brought more fear. It made me very much aware of everything that was around me. I wanna take this moment now to ask that, let's be hopeful. Let's hope that there will be better days when we look outside, not in fear, but in hope. Once all this is over, which it will be hopefully very soon, I want a lot of the seniors now to go out and to explore the world, to do everything that they want to do, to go out and appreciate every single second that they spend with their friends. I want to tell the class of 2020 to not be feeling down or to just feel disappointed because class of 2020 was basically very much different. I want us to embrace this difference and know that the class of 2020 will be like no other. It will be the best class and we will always be remembered because we will go down in history. With this being said, I want to thank God for letting us get through this year. And I very much wish happiness and fortune to all of my class of 2020. And may we all thrive in the future because the class of 2020 will always be the best.